Hello everyone and welcome to Aviation A to Z. Module 10. When people hear this, they think it's very difficult. I can say that it is not a difficult but it takes equal hard work and smart work. Since you need to go through each and every pages of a syllabus. And not only that, you also need to go through other various documents. But don't worry, I will guide you and make your path very easy. So let's get started. Remember that the proper planning is the key to success. Don't read anything without proper planning. Every module I give, I make a proper planning and I clear all my modules in my first attempt because I planned and executed properly. So today I will guide you how I planned and executed and also not to forget to dedicate all this knowledge to my beloved instructor Mr. Saurabh Singh sir. He is behind many students who clear their module 10. So moving on, DGCA may take 3 to 4 months to put another session. So, you got only 4 months for a mountain like module 10, but not to worry, let's plan it. The most important topic in CR or module 10, such things are fish, because each and everything is important. Because the syllabus is so vast that DGC can put anything in its question bank. So, we will study and remember each and everything. So, we have the main CRs, which are CR 66, 145, M, 147 and 21 are the starters for the module 10. I always say that refer CR66 for syllabus which includes each and everything for the mod 10. So after studying all the main CRs in detail we will go through the section 2 which is airworthiness. First of all make a folder in your PC or mobile. Name it module 10 and then make subfolder of all the effective series such as B, C, E, F, H, I, M, R, T and X which we are going to study. The series and CRs, if you study it, there is only 5% chance of passing alone studying this because it includes the weightage of 20 to 25 marks only. The rest 15 to 20 marks are of different documents and information which are very vital. But still as I said early, everything is important in module 10. The documents are to be studied after main CRs and series, they are as follows. CAP 3100 of SMS which is included in section 1 series C part 1 Yasa textbook for mod 10 section 8 in which there are different topics which are recently the favorite of DGCA if you didn't study section 8 your chance of clearing the module 10 comes down to 50% and less than dead this is the value of section 8 of the DGCA also the FTST which is fuel tank safety training which is included in the CR 66, 145 and M why then I choose a separate because of its important and all time favorite of the DGCA. Next is AAC or Airworthiness Advisory Circulars which is published on DGCA site are really a game changer. The CAR is all about rule and regulation. So how can we forget the acts and rules of 1934 and 1937 respectively. The CA forms are really a X factor for clearing the model 10. I have made my notes of each and every topic which I mentioned above. That is sufficient to score 30 marks, but for scoring and getting a good mark, you need to go through each and every page. I will provide my notes as per my videos on particular topics such as series note will be provided when I will teach you the series. So today we will begin with the introductory part of the CAR and I want you to promise that you will work hard and smart and not waste your precious time in playing stupid games and wasting it on other things because we are on the edge to start the preparation for the module 10 and I want each and everyone who is watching my videos yes you only to clear and I will give my 100% to make your module clear are you ready to give your 100% comment below so according to syllabus we have a regulatory framework for this you need to understand what is regulatory bodies for example I am from India for me the regulatory body is DGCA if you are from Europe for you YASA and Similarly, if you are from US, FAR, for Canada, TCCA and for the whole world, ICAO. So just watch my video on what is ICAO, FAR and DGCA in which I have explained it in very precise manner. Next topic is the relationship between the CRs. The CR21 is a production organization which will be maintained by 145. The CRM provides the regulation for continuing airworthiness for the maintenance organization which is again linked with CR145. The CR66 provides the syllabus for every maintenance personnel and other tasks. Then CR147 is a type training which provides a type rated engineer to CR145 maintenance organization. The CR66 
is again giving a syllabus regarding all the CR 147 so all are interrelated and very important to study the AIC which is aeronautical information circulars are not very popular because I haven't seen DGC asking question from this topic now as I previously mentioned about sections remember that there are 11 sections in general for DGCA you can go through each and every sections by going to its official website dgca.nic.in the link is already presented in description box there are sections 11 section which is starting with section 1 general section 2 airworthiness section 3 air transport section 4 aer aerodrome standard and licensing section 5 air safety section 6 design standard and type certification section 7 flight crew standard training and licensing section 8 aircraft operation which is very important section 9 air space and air navigation services standards section 10 aviation environment protection section 11 safe transport of dangerous goods by air in which we have to study section 2 very deeply other things to study are full forms for clear understanding like dgc stands for director general of civil aviation cr civil aviation requirement ICAO, International Civil Aviation Organization, YASA, European Aviation Safety Agency, FAA, Federal Aviation Administration, and so on. And many other which I have given in my notes. So go through each and everything. Also, the link is in the description. That's it for the today. In our next video, we will be starting with CR66. So fasten your seatbelt and get ready for the adventurous and full of excitement journey of Module 10. Subscribe and click on the bell icon. Do not miss my upcoming videos and join module 10 whatsapp group link is in description and in which i will solve all your doubt and provide you extra knowledge till then enjoy the aviation and keep watching aviation a to z